Welcome to my demo of the inverter. This is a simple educational tool to help you internalize matrix inversion specifically. So here we got a matrix that is invertible and the identity on the other side. And you can do subtractions, swaps or multiplies as you would expect. And the game shows you progress in terms of the different steps. Uh, as you progress, you'll see what they are. Um, this is a very rudimentary version of the interface. So, here we go. I want to first of all set that to 1, so I'll multiply that by 0.5. I can say by half. And there we go, we've got 1 there, and the first tick points first pivot normalized to 1. Great. I want to then subtract 2 from 1, so it says how many times. I want to remove it by 9. And now we've got a zero, and the same here for this one, minus three, subtract three times, negative three times the first row from the second row, and you get those two. And then the same for minus eight, subtract minus eight, and you get zero. Okay, now we just continue, we want to set this to one, so it's one eleventh. You can also put decimals, but fractions are easier. Okay, and I'm going to multiply this by negative one ninth as well to set that to one, and that one also to minus one twelfth. You can uh, do it in two steps or one, but obviously that doesn't really matter. And now we're just going to subtract the first from the second, multiply it by one, and the first from the second. In that case, subtract from one as well. Now we're looking pretty good. I kept these as what are called um, improper fractions because then the reciprocals are really easy. Uh, so this one, the reciprocal is negative 99 over 193. So it's negative 99 over 193. And that's become 1. And then this one, uh, we want to. Um, oh, what I lost track of here. So I want to subtract this from that. I think I did something wrong there. Let's have a look. So we want to subtract 1, negative 140 by 25. Negative 143 over 125. And we get a 0. And then we multiply this by the reciprocal of that, which is negative 94 over negative 191. And now we've got the second point, reduced echelon form. See? Okay, and, or the third one actually. So. That's pretty good. Sometimes you have the step of echelon form, but this actually went straight to reduced echelon form, and now we do the reverse convert. Now we do reverse um, substitution, so we want to subtract negative 1 over 193 times the first row from the second row, and we get another 0. And the same again from these two. I want to subtract a negative 5 elements of the second row from the first row, first row from the second row, I get another 0, and this is simple, this is just a simple multiplication of 1. Now I'm going to do the same here, which is we want to get rid of that and make that a 0, so we subtract 92 20 seconds of the second row, of the first row times the second row, and the same again here, and subtract Minus one. Over, okay, I'm pretty sure that's right. Yep, okay. And then we've got one last step, which is um, subtract the first from the second, and it's minus time one times that, and yay, identity matrix. And we have won the game. We have won the game of inversion. Thank you for watching. That is all.